I'm going to show you how to connect an Eden monitor directly to a Mac computer without putting the Eden monitor on the local network. So if you are a mobile anesthesiologist or something who shows up somewhere and you may not have full control over the network you are connecting to, uh, this can be a great option. And to do that, we need an Ethernet cable and then we need just a little adapter um, since this laptop doesn't have an Ethernet port on it. So next we need to set up our monitor to be connected to this. So we want to make sure that we go to maintenance, user maintain, type A, B, C, uppercase, hit OK. Go to network maintain. And then right now it's set on Wi-Fi. We want to switch it to wired and we're going to hit config. So um, this can be set to static or dynamic. You want it to be set to dynamic. And you'll see there it flashed for a second and then it shows this number, it's still in gray, but this is actually the current IP address of this particular monitor. So it's 192, 168, two and three. Next, we need to configure the network settings on the laptop to allow for this. Um, so what we're gonna do is open system preferences and select network. So we have Wi-Fi that we're actually getting internet from, and then we have this USB-C that says self-assigned IP. So when you first plug this in, if it's not connected, it'll look red like that. And then after you click plug it in and turn on the monitor, it may take a second, but it should get to where it says um, that it has a connection. And then it should say self-assigned IP. All right, so now it's connected. It says we have an IP address for the device here, which is great. And next thing we need to do is go to our internet sharing. First, select the correct item over here, the Belkin USB-C. And then we're gonna say internet sharing. We're gonna turn that on. It's gonna say, are you sure? Yes. And at this point, we've created a bridge between the computer and the monitor. So uh, without the monitor being directly connected to the internet, we have now given our computer the ability to communicate with it. You can go to xchart.com slash downloads and you can grab uh, the Mac Windows or Mac app, uh, depending on your platform. I have it installed here, I'm gonna switch back to it. We've just opened a new case here. I'm gonna hit Connect Vitals Monitor up in the corner and select Eden. And it's gonna immediately try to do a scan of the local network. And these scans can take a little bit. Um, sometimes when you first connect it, sometimes it won't recognize it. But uh, let's see if it finds it here. So in this case, it didn't find it. We just connected it, this isn't too surprising. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and just hit Enter IP manually. So for that, if you remember over here, we're gonna type in the IP address we saw, which is 192.168.2.3 and connect. And at this point, it found it immediately and it automatically selected the vitals that we're tracking and it started tracking the case here.